Hi there, safety conscious haulers. Today we're going to be taking a look at Optronics sealed two and a half inch LED side marker lights. These are available in either amber for the front of your trailer or red for the rear of your trailer. And this is what our light's going to look like when it's installed. It's a standard two and a half inch round light that'll fit directly into where your old ones were. They simply just push right into the grommet and they use a standard two-prong connector on the back so they plug right in. Inside of our light we'll have eight LEDs that will produce a brighter, more crisp light than your standard incandescent bulbs would. They're also going to last about 50 times longer than your typical incandescents. The incandescent bulbs are usually replaceable, but this is completely sealed and waterproof, so it's maintenance free. You'll never need to replace anything inside, and with it being completely sealed and waterproof, it makes a great replacement or upgrade for any trailer that's going to be in the water, particularly for boat trailers where you're going to be loading and unloading your boat. We're now here at the back of the trailer where you can see our red lens. And this light's going to have all the same features as the amber one at the front. It just has a red lens because it's designed to be installed on the rear side of your trailer. And both of the lenses, whether it be the amber or the red, will have a reflector built into them. This reflex reflector is nice, especially around the time of day where the sun's starting to go down, but maybe your automatic lights in your truck hasn't turned on yet, but it's still lower light, but maybe other people's have, and the lights will reflect off of this improving the visibility when the lights aren't illuminated. Both the amber and the red lenses are going to be P2 rated, so they're designed for side marker applications. They'll both be DOT compliant in all states as long as they're installed in the correct location. Remember that amber is for the front of your trailer and red is for the rear. And compared to your incandescent bulbs, both are going to be brighter at night increasing your visibility, keeping you safer while driving at night. We can see our old light here, and this is why we're gonna be replacing it. This old one here is damaged. Our new light's gonna make a great replacement or upgrade if you've got incandescent bulbs and you're just wanting to get those out of there for something more modern, that's more efficient and maintenance-free that will last longer. When you're wanting to replace it, you'll wanna first remove your old light. If you can, reach in the back side. Pushing it out from the back's usually the easiest way. If not, you can use a screwdriver to work it out of the grommet. We can then disconnect our electrical connector on the back side. This is just a standard two-prong wire. So we're going to disconnect that. If your bulb was hardwired, you would need to cut the wires to remove it. Now, this connector is going to be necessary to install our new lights. So if you do not have this connector on your trailer, you'd want to pick one of these connectors up here at eTrailer.com so you can quickly connect your new light. We can then clean out any dirt that's inside of our grommet there just to make it easier to get our new light in. A lot of times the easiest way to do that is just to pop the grommet out, knock the dirt out, and then put it back in. If your grommet is damaged and you need a new one, we have some available here at eTrailer.com that you can purchase along with your lights. Now that we've got our grommet cleaned out and our old one removed, we can take our new light and we're just simply going to plug the connector right into the back of the light. It's pretty tight for this style of light as it is a pressed fit type connector. They do already come pre-greased with dielectric grease, but if you'd like to add some more, it's okay to do so. If you need some dielectric grease, you can get some at eTrailer.com here. We'll then just put it in our grommet, starting with one side and just working it around until it pops into place. We're then ready to hook it up to our truck and verify everything's working. We've plugged ours into our tester, and when we turn it on, we can see that it illuminates and everything's working properly. And that completes our look at Optronics sealed two and a half inch LED side marker lights.